I'm going to show you how to unlock the TID Radio TDH3 to uh, get it to its full potential. Uh, a lot of these radios come, depending on how you buy it, uh, locked to certain specifications. So when you go to turn it on, if you hold the top left button and the star button in, click it on. When it boots up, it'll give you three options. So sometimes it'll come set up as just a ham radio function, and that restricts it to a certain range to where you don't uh, end up having someone transmitting in a, a range that may be illegal in their region or uh, country or for whatever reason restricted, uh, or the GMRS settings, or normal, which normal is basically unlocked as much as it will unlock. Um, if you want to set it in that position, just click three. And when you select this, you got to be careful because it'll erase a lot of your data and savings on here. So if you have it set up already to a certain way with functions working the way you want it, things saved in it, this will erase it. So if it's good to do this when you first start out, make it open. And then you can do all your settings. You don't have to worry about it anymore. But to select that, just click the Yes button again. And then it'll boot up under that. So it'll allow you a uh, full range of functions on it, ham radio and all. So uh, then you go back and put Save It the way you want, change your settings, program it. And that way you won't uh, end up losing anything down the road and be a little disappointed or have to spend a hours again reprogramming things. So that's the as unlocked as you're going to get it uh, right now without using any custom firmware. So if this helped you out at all, please uh, like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.